Inside eukaryotic cells, which are complex cells that have organelles, genetic information is stored in a structure called the nucleus, known as the control center of the cell. The nucleus is contained by a double membrane called the nuclear envelope, which works to protect the DNA by controlling what types of molecules can enter or exit. The nuclear envelope uses pores that allow certain substances to enter and leave. Inside the nucleus is an area called the nucleolus. The nucleolus plays an important role in turning genetic information into reality. RNA is synthesized in the nucleolus from the DNA code that makes up who you are. Parts of ribosomes, a cell organelle, are made in the nucleolus and moved through pores in the nuclear envelope. A new piece of furniture is usually carried through a doorway as a box full of materials before it's assembled inside a house. That's a way that the pores in the nuclear envelope work with ribosomes. Once the subunits of ribosomes are transported outside the nuclear envelope, they can be assembled. Ribosomes are very important to living things. They're the site where proteins are made. Proteins are used in the body to build structures. In the same way that lumber is used to build a house, proteins are the scaffolding of the human body. When cells divide, they need to pass genetic information onto new cells. The genetic information in the nucleus is stored in long strings of DNA called chromatin. When cells prepare to divide, they organize their DNA. Chromatin is condensed down into structures called chromosomes. Chromosomes are split and passed on to offspring in order to pass a copy of DNA to newly formed cells. Possibly the most important part of cells, their DNA, is protected and stored in the nucleus.